Now, this mandate from the governor, as you saw, forcing countless bars and restaurants to make adjustments. Kelsey Kushner is live in Fells Point right now with how they're adapting to those big changes. Rather deserted there, Kelsey, I imagine. Yeah, well, Denise, I'm standing in the road here in Fells Point, and the only reason I'm able to do that is because there's not a lot of traffic coming through here. All of these bars and restaurants completely shut down at 5 p.m. today, forcing a lot of people to stay inside. It was a bittersweet moment for owners Melissa and John at Penny Black in Fells Point. I thought this was coming. But I was really surprised it was so soon. Um, I thought I'd have a few days to prepare and transition from being open to being carry out. They closed up shop at 5 p.m. on Monday after Governor Larry Hogan made the announcement to shut down all bars, restaurants, movie theaters, and gyms in the state. However, the order does still allow for restaurants to continue carry out drive through and delivery services. We're sort of figuring it out as we go. A lot of it is going to depend on what. Um, what kind of um, food we can get delivered. As coronavirus cases rise, Towson Town Center and White Marsh Mall shut down their food courts and announced changes to their hours, operating now only from noon to 7 p.m. Monday through Saturday. This is uh, a serious crisis that we need to take seriously, and so I, I think that there will be more adjustments made um, daily, if not hourly, as we continue to move forward into what's ahead. Shoppers say they rush to stores to run last-minute errands. It, it's quiet for sure. I mean, there's definitely not as many people there. I went to the Apple store today and they were closed. We drove all the way down here just to get a slice of cheesecake before they closed. So I think that's the best thing, though. I really do. With typically busy streets now empty, many are hoping the end is in sight. It's a little ominous, I guess, but I see a lot of people staying positive through it. Now, many local shops and restaurants are urging customers to call ahead, especially over the next coming days as their hours and restrictions might change. We also want to make a point that the East Point Mall and Security Square Mall are also operating Monday through Saturday from noon to 7 p.m., except on Sundays. Reporting live tonight, Kelsey Kirshner for WJC.